Hey guys, watching on YouTube today, I will be doing a review on the Halo Mega Bloks Pelican. It has quite a lot of detail to it, like click hinge wing, I'll start off with. With the click hinge wing, it's in the name, it clicks to stay in place. But again, sometimes when I twist the wing, the right wing, it sometimes falls off because like, Mega Bloks isn't the same quality as Lego, as people say. Uh, it also has a cockpit here, which comes with a m marine pilot. I haven't got the Spartans that come with it, I don't remember where I put them. Well, I'll start off with the Magnum. It's got like this little handle on it. So like the marine would hold it here and the trigger would be there. This has got quite a lot of detail from the actual Halo game, I'd say. Yeah, well, we'll pop that back in the Marine's hand. That is how he grips it. And he also has the pilot visor, and looks quite a lot like a Marine as well. So, they've done quite a lot of detail on the characters. Pretty cool. So, the engines on the back also have a click hinge. This again just to keep them in place. The top to the cargo bay opens so you can get your men in and out. I'll try and get you guys a good view. It's not a very good view, but it's really dark in there. Put this back there. And the cargo bay rear doorway just like opens up so you just get your men in and out of there. And yeah. Well, like I said, loads of detail. And if uh, if you are wanting to get this set for Mega Bloks, I would advise you actually have Lego if you're going to get this, like those Lego boxes or something. Because when I bought this, it took about. Well, it took four days in between breaks because I got this at Christmas. So, like, I was going around people's houses and everything, so I didn't have a lot of time on it. My mum had a friend round, so I didn't really get it finished that day. So, I finally got it finished, uh, like, four days after Christmas or something. Yep. But the thing is, the pieces are really hard to find because of the camo. Just give you guys a quick look at it just for a minute. Just have a quick look. It's got on the bottom these little lights that just go either side of the gun. That's not really the gun, it's like as it comes with a Spartan with a sword on his back, I mistaked the, the gun for the sword because I thought it was inside a holder. It wasn't a very smart mistake to make. So I've got like this little part here. The parts are really fine because they're like camo. Got some sticker detail. It also says down here, Marines. It just says down the side here on the back. And underneath here says UNSC, United Nations Space Command. I was just, you guys, have, if you've noticed this part here, that's because I'm going to show you a trick that you can do with a UNSC Warthog. If you see, they're like little holes in the bottom underneath the engine. If you clip these to the second to last one, so let me try and find it. Third to last, sorry. Clip, try and clip that in. Really resisting. Try on the other side. Ah! Doesn't seem to want to go in today. Yeah, well, usually if you put this in, you have one of these chains. If you put it in one of these holes. Just doesn't want to work for me. If you put it in one of the hole in the holes here, I'll show you the motion that happens with the warthog. 
so let's say this is clipped in up here with the other part you wrap it round here like there make sure you have enough room to like spin it over again just like click it to both sides and then you should be able to well clip your ward dog onto the back so that's about it i'd say it's not a very big set i have quite a lot of reviews coming up i'll just quickly show you how much of uh, how many sets i have mm, that's just some of them as you can see there i've got quite a few they're not all of them i have some in my cupboards so like that's it for the UNSC Pelican. Hope you guys enjoyed the review and I hope it helped you make your choice if you're planning to get this. And subscribe and rate up. Cheers guys for watching. I'm Born Hacker. I will leave my Xbox 360 gamer tag in the description. So feel free to add me. Cheers guys. See ya.